guys and welcome back to a new video on my channel. It is Sunday today and I have no more plans for the rest of the day. It's about noon and I just want to chill out. But I also need to do a reset. I feel like a lot of the times with my resets I tend to focus really hard on the reset and not so much on the just like relaxing and chilling out on my Sunday. And today we're gonna focus on the relaxing a little bit more. I am still gonna do a reset. My place is kind of a tip right now. It does need a lot of cleaning. I do need to do some stuff, but I'm gonna wait and I'm gonna focus on that this evening. And I think I'm really just gonna chill out this afternoon and just do some fun stuff. Just watch some YouTube videos. I have some Lego that I wanna do. Maybe a jigsaw puzzle if I'm feeling in the mood. It's also like a dreary, rainy day out today. Like, it's just not the, the nicest of days. It's a little miserable, a little rainy, but that's okay. This is kind of my favorite kind of day. Also, if you're new here, hi, my name is Zoe. I am 23 and I make lifestyle content. I just graduated a year ago, so I'm just trying to document my life post-grad. Also, I can't believe I graduated a year ago. That is actually like, crazy. I feel like maybe I should stop saying this in the intro, like it's not that new of a thing anymore, but it still feels kind of new to me. Anyway, I am going to put the TV on and I'm going to do some Lego because I have been waiting to do this for a while. My friend got me this Lego like months ago for hitting a thousand subscribers on YouTube and I just haven't had a chance to do it, so today's the day. decoration. I swear most of my apartment is just like a decor. Thank you Grace. Love you. Miss you. <laughs> okay, it is a little bit later now. I finished my Lego and I've just been sat reading for a little bit. I've been reading Just for the Summer by Abby Jimenez, I think is how you say her name. And this is my book of the month from April and I'm really, really liking this book. Like I'm having a great time reading it. I kind of just want to like sit and read this for the rest of the day. But there are things to be done. I need to make some lunch. I am currently filming like a what I eat in a day for a few days. So that video, I'm not sure if that'll go up before or after this, but if you haven't checked that out, then make sure to go see that if you wanna see what I'm making, but I'll give you a little sneak peek. I think I'm gonna make this like chicken, um, rice, like paper wraps. So hopefully that'll be good. Okay, I had to change it to a t-shirt because I'm gonna be frying chicken which means it gets dirty. The sweater that I was just wearing, like I couldn't like roll the sleeves up, they wouldn't stay down, and it's white. And I figured probably best not to get it all dirty. <laughs> procrastinate doing this reset any longer. It is 3.30, so let's clean.
a great movie. Like, arguably, I probably prefer the music in the second movie to the music in the first movie, but it's so much more sad and it makes me cry. <laughs> because I have this one linen shirt that has been getting so crumpled up after I wash it that I was like, I need to get an iron because I love wearing that shirt to work. The place is honestly looking so much better. My room is looking way cleaner. And so is the kitchen and the bathroom. And I'm starting to get quite hungry, so I think I'm gonna make myself some dinner. I have some fish, and I'm gonna cook some rice, and I think like some kind of, I think I might put like broccoli on the side in the air fryer, so it should be yummy. So while my dinner is cooking, I do just wanna get in a little bit of movement today, but I'm not like in the mood for anything crazy, so I think I'm just gonna do like 30 minutes of stretching and try to really like do some like deep stretches and stuff while this is cooking since it's a pretty hands-off dinner. the dinner actually looks so good and I'm so hungry I'm so excited to eat this okay so it is a little bit later now I've just been doing some stuff for planning some trips which is very exciting I'm gonna go and take a shower now it's an everything shower kind of night so I'm gonna do a hair mask beforehand and then clean up in the kitchen from dinner okay so I just got my hair all wet and then I have the Olaplex number three to put in it. So I am all done with my shower, which was so nice. And the last thing that I like to do on a Sunday night is just a plan for the week and set up my bullet journal for the next week. So that is what I'm gonna do right now. These are like my three main notebooks that I've been using at the minute. So I have obviously my bullet journal and then I also have a planner, which is just like, I like to write down things like for the future, like, I don't know, like just like more high level, kind of like jot down stuff. And there's a lot more space for me to write in this than I usually make in my bullet journal. And then the last thing I have is just this little notebook, which is where I'm trying to get into the habit of planning content. So, let's do it. Actually, I need more pens. <laughs> Okay, you guys, I am all ready for bed and I'm literally gonna head straight to sleep. I hope that you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, then make sure to like and subscribe and I'll see you in my next one.